Ladies and gentlemen, there is a very important news on ground. This one is a very important news because since they bombed me when I take all this life, I know they are small, low, but since they bombed me when I take all this life, I've not seen something like this before. What is happening? The president said all services should vacate office immediately two days ago. Was that not on Monday? Chief of Army staff, Chief of Naval staff, Chief of Audio Defense Headquarters uh, uh, team. They should vacate office immediately. As I am talking to you, Chief of Army staff don't vacate. Chief of Air Force staff don't vacate. Uh, everybody has vacated. I said to one person, Chief of Naval staff said not to go anywhere. He said, I will wait till Friday. They don't fact, everybody don't come out since Monday. Him say he get money when he owe some people. So, a country at 20 award. So, the tunes of billions of naira, millions of dollars. He said, until he paid that money on Friday. Say, now they go in there. They don't beg and tire. Man, read the news for now. Exclusive. Chief of Naval Staff, Zubair Gambo, refuses to hand over to Ike Shuku Ogala. Insist on paying billions to contractors before leaving office. Naval Chief Awa Zubai Rugambo has remained in office and rejected pleas to hand over to power to his successor, Ikechuku Ogala. People's Gazette was told today, two days after President Bola Tinibu approved changes at the top brass of the nation's military. Mr. Gambo, 57, said he would leave office on Friday because he had to pay contractors and naval officers from an outstanding capital vote to the tune of billions of naira before leaving office, according to multiple sources at the Nigerian Navy headquarters in Abuja. Mr. Gambo, who was appointed by President Buhari on January 26, 2021, was fired on Monday by Mr. Tinibu, the new Nigerian leader who assumed office on May 29. Mr. Tinubu said, Mr. Gambo and his counterparts in the Nigerian Army and the Nigerian Air Force should immediately vacate office with new chiefs named forthwith. While other service chiefs have since departed following the June 19 presidential directive, Mr. Gambo had lingered in office, saying he has some unfinished business to wind up, according to sources familiar with the development. The chief of naval staff is still here. He saw us to the Gazette from the Nigerian Navy headquarters in Abuja. We have been begging him to comply with the order of the president and vacate office for the new person that was appointed. Mr. Gambo reportedly said he was responsible for the release of funds to the Nigerian Navy and will not be leaving office until entitled contractors and naval officers have been paid. Sources said Mr. Gambo insisted that the payment to contractors may be delayed by his successor even though he was assured that the Navy would meet all valid contractual obligations. He wants to pay contractors himself, he not trust the federal government, and all that na naval officers, some billions in capital. A senior naval officer told the Gazette, we have never seen anything like this before in our service. He should realize that any action he takes after the president's public announcement is null and void. In the Nigerian Navy, the official added. Mr. Gambo also said he wanted to oversee the disbursement of millions of dollars for emergency repair work on the NNS Aradu, one of the largest ships in the Navy. He also mentioned that he was finalizing payments for the repair of NNS Aradu, despite our conclusion that the ship should be decommissioned and sent to the Naval Museum, he so said. The Navy, under Mr. Gambo, had reportedly budgeted $200 million for the repairs, even though it was advised to take the ship, first commissioned in 1980, out of service. Mr. Gambo did not return a request seeking comments from the Gazette about his decision to remain in office. Mr. Tinibu is away on, on an official trip to France, and the presidential spokesperson did not immediately return a request seeking comment. So basically, what did they have here? They say this ship, so is a ship that had been in operation since 1980. The ship get fought. When they want to repair the ship, a team tell us, say, no, let's remove this ship from the Nigerian Navy and put it in the Navy Museum. Say not too old. Chairman say he must repair the ship. He issued the contract to engineers repairing the ship. What he did not know, he said they go to sack up, or rather, they go to retire up. 
Now the president retired them without letting them even suspect. Retired them and told them to hand over immediately. Every other person have hand over. Army, Air Force, every other person have hand over. Remaining him, he said until he paid the contractors. You know, the commotion will come out on Friday. So now, now, now they tell us when he go leave the office. Now they tell the president when he go obey order that your job is over. Until you don't pay guys. Oh, sorry. Until you don't pay contractors. So the issue contract to he not they go anywhere. He not trust the new person when they come say the person will uphold the agreement. And if like I say this guy matter now, even the person where they call say, be like saying join the people will be told say may they not repair the ship. That is the only thing we go to make the presidency of Navy start the fear. You understand? Now he must pay them. Because for uh, Tinibu no data, you see, this disobedience to law and order when the presidency starts. I know say very soon everybody will carry on for head. Because today with the courts we give an order. I said, do this. Presidency will disobey. They will give an order to EFCC, but sin will disobey. They will give order to DSS, they will disobey. Now, never, ship of never stop, now not going to disobey. Everybody is doing chuku, 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 according to the words of Bobby's wife in Benin. I talk to them that they are doing one, 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 chuku, chuku, chuku. Everybody is trying to do the way they like. For the culture, everybody is trying to grace. God, they are talking here for tribunal. Everybody you know, they do any and I with the season. Now wait it's never go do this man. Now nah, once he but not fear that he if he's shocked or that nobody go do anything. But many friends they come back. Man, you know, not come on that place. No, if I put the one you do now, so you'll be like saying you don't take trouble. Because your team are not just one side because your can never come on. Maybe man not talk.